Hey, hey nerds, Coughlot back here with a small companion script for our performance uh, script. Um, as you probably know, especially if you're not in our Discord, I hate developing for phones because no one can implement it and everyone's complaining about it. It's annoying to dev with and yeah, whatever. Um, so I decided to just uh, make my own menu instead for performance since rather than having it in the phone, it's much easier to just have it on display all the time. Um, so we decided to just use an, a tool called an OBD tool, or OBD scanner. Uh, so these are called onboard diagnostic tools, RL. Um, and they are used by mechanics to diagnose cars and stuff. And you know, I figured, you know, it's fun to use, whatever. Uh, so if you use this, it opens a QB menu that has two, by default, it has two options. The overlay and the sensor menu. Uh, this is uh, for Rensu sensor. If you want to use anything else, you'll have to go into the code and fix that yourself. But the tuning overlay looks like this. Very simple. It ties to the nearest car you're in, or nearest two, which means you don't even need to be in the car to see how it how it performs or what it is inside. Good for like if you want to make sure everyone got decent cars when you're starting a race or whatever. Uh, and since this is using the later CV performance, which you need to use this script, you'll be able to actually see upgrades, as you can see the difference here between this photo that's upgraded and this photo that is stuck. Um, and since this updates dynamically, uh, if you use this, for example, with our customs, um, and you add an upgrade, I, I'm not sure how this will work for your customs or whatever you use, but for this customs, it since they apply the upgrades and then they remove them or whatever, you can actually see if you want to like, for example, tune a car into a class still, forever, whatever reason, you can do that. Yeah, um, to turn it off, you just toggle it back off, bam, done. I think that's it. Bye.